this video will show you how to make a really simple slideshow uh, photo essay with uh, just your images and a voiceover narration. So what we'll be using today is our preview from the Mac and also uh, QuickTime Player to do our screen capturing and our uh, voiceover. So the first thing you'll, what you'll want to do is um, get your images ready to go. So I have these in a folder over here. So I'll just double click these. I will then select them all. I will do a right click. I'm going to say open with preview. Um, in the background I can minimize this. And next what I want to do now is um, at this moment I would probably get my QuickTime player ready go, for, uh, to record. So recording this screencast I'm actually using it so I'll probably just talk about these and actually instead of actually um, going through the process so back to our preview so if you go to view you're gonna say enter full screen um, now if I had now I would go to my QuickTime player and I'd say okay we're going to do file new screen recording and once I click that, uh, it'll, it'll have a red dot for me to, to hit record. And then uh, once it's recording, I'll go back to my preview. And then I just start to begin my photo essay. So I'll just start talking. Uh, I'll advance my slides with the arrow key on the, key, on the keyboard. Um, so after you're done, uh, you'll go back to your um, QuickTime, come back, uh, pop, open it up. Um, normally, you would hit this um, to stop the recording, but I'm not going to do that right now, so um, I can keep on describing what's going on. So in your video, you would hit rec stop recording. You would then come over here to edit and select trim. The trim will give you basically a line of of uh, the whole video you just shot, um, you'll notice that there's kind of some preparation going back and forth. So you can actually trim the beginning and trim the back ends. And so what you'll be left with is just the slide presentation itself. Uh, you won't see the preparation at the beginning and you won't see uh, you switching back and forth to QuickTime to stop the recording. Uh, once that's done, you just save it. Uh, this will be an MOV file. Um, this will be uh, can be used to up upload into your blogger um, or whatever uh, blogging platform you decide to use, uh, and that's it. So the, again, this is using just your preview and QuickTime to create a photo essay with just images and audio uh, voiceover narration. Thanks.